Going over here now... I think this is the shopping center, where you can go check out food from Moira, Moira Brown. Um, so yeah. If it is, then that means there's raiders around here, which means they want to kill and rape you. Wow, I'm surprised that didn't hurt me. Kinda cool, I guess. So, yeah. As you can see, we're not doing anything really too evil around here. Fast travel, you've discovered several locations. You can use... Yeah, yeah, I know about that. I hate how the game interrupts you like that, like, Hey, guess what? This is probably something you already know if you're already playing through the game. Hey, what's wrong with you? you just got up and ran away from me. Alright, then. You can talk to her and get some stuff, but, uh... Grandma going a little bit crazy. Crazy grandma. Crazy thing. Okay, I'm shutting up now. <laughs> I'm trying to sound funny, and it's not working. Alright, then. I wonder how far I am. Pretty far. If you're wondering what we're looking for, we're looking for a giant ship. Which a bunch of people turned into a pretty cool town. So, yeah. No, we can't blow up the ship like we can make a ton. So, yeah. I'm not doing it because, like I said, intelligence, and you do almost anything in this game, you do get experience points for it, which is very nice. But experience points mean leveling up, and like I said, and as you already said, there's a 30... At level 30, you have a cap for your level, meaning you can't go any higher. Which, uh, kind of sucks. Not, to be quite honest. And because we can't go any higher, you want to be smart, and, um, try to maximize the amount of stuff you can get. Obviously, me not putting anything in the small guns is really going to help out, because that's what people mostly put their stuff into, and having a low amount in small guns means... Okay, I know there's raiders around Yep, there's raiders around here. Be careful. If I can hurry, I can get over here there real fast from over here. I'll have to take some fall damage, but I think that's fine. Ah! I didn't realize I was low on health. Wow. Huh. Going to have to fix that with a few stim packs. Actually, I sh <laughs> what I should do is what I always do. You can hot link your, uh, the Citadel. Cool. Yeah, more than likely you're going to run into, uh, raiders over here that attack you, and then go over here, and there's the good guys over here, which are still end up being kind of assholes at the same time. Because this is the Brotherhood of Steel. Waiting for the Raiders, my friend? Not talking to him because it's just going to waste time. This is the Brotherhood of Steel. They're not going to let us inside because we're a civilian. Stand aside, civilian. Here's a fucking sentry belt. Look at this goddamn thing. It's awesome. It's, it has its own missile and minigun built in. That is so awesome. And these guys are going crazy for some reason. Maybe it's because they're usually scripted to fight the, um, raiders in the, uh, beginning. Usually, usually I think. I think they're scripted. And I say that because, um, I say they're scripted because, where is it? Stimpax. Didn't mean to do that, but I was going to do it anyway. Stimpax heals a bunch of health. Keep that in mind. Oh, I thought I was pushing too. No, I did not mean to push that button. We'll hot link, uh, baseball to four. Cool. Anyway, what I was trying to say, you want to hot link, uh, your stem packs to your closest known button, such as the one button, so you can heal up real fast. Well, if you get lucky, some of these guys can... Oh, people's... Yeah, yeah, yeah. More signals you can check out if you want to. I'm not going to, because I'm trying to hurry up and finish this off, at least getting to, uh... The one place which I forgot about. What about you? What's wrong with you? Hey there. You look hurt. Hunched over. Hey, here are their uh, turrets. Mark II turret. Very cool. Holy shit! What the fuck are those things? Super mutant. Wait, no. 
Yeah, super mutants are actually very important. Uh, it's kind of weird why the super mutants are still fighting, considering the fact in the first game the problem was apparently all solved, but... Guess they stopped that. And that guy actually spits out shit, keep that in mind. Can't aim worth shit because of my small guns, goddammit. So, yeah. Um, no, I want my bet. There we go. Super mutants usually have good stuff on them. They're very strong, however. So be careful. Okay, there's no more super mutants around here. Miss me. God, look at how ugly that thing is. It's got like a thousand tongues coming out of his mouth. Bitch. Bring it on! Oh. Come on. I don't know if I told you this, but if you hold down the bad ah. button, you can do you can do like a a powerful hit type of thing. You can get centaur meat off of him. I wouldn't because I bet it's not healthy to eat that. Super mutant. Look at the damn thing. Hunting rifle. Stronger a weapon in the game. I'll be selling that. Yeah, usually the super mutants either carry mini guns, yes, mini guns, or a uh, mini guns or whimsy little uh, whimsy or little. Uh, Hunting rifles. Just they're not carrying pistols. Yeah, it's usually mostly what the, that. Usually miniguns, that, and uh, if you find the higher level ones, such as the Overlord, they carry huge fucking lasers. And okay, I think we're getting closer to our destination. Wait, no, we're not. Apparently, I'm going in the wrong direction because I'm a fucking idiot. It's over there. I'm gonna go look at this thing over here, though. It seems to be lighting up. Hmm. Hey, let's have a nuke on it. Occupied. Shelter. Looks like you didn't make it. Ooh. Guns and bullets. Yes. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Wait for radiation to clear. Enjoy your stay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright then, this is another skills thing. Small guns. They're skill bucks. They increase your stuff. Guns and bullets obviously increase your small guns. Said I wasn't going to increase small guns, but if it's by a, um... If it's by a goddamn, uh... Sorry. I didn't mean to do that. If it's by a skill buck, really, I'm not going to sell the skill bucks. They sell for a little bit, but not by much, but still use them anyway. Um, so, yeah. If you don't like that, then I increase my skills by that when I'm only being increased by one so far, then fuck you. Um, like, it really fucking matters. I'm weak at the beginning of the game. I'm trying to do I'm trying to do this run as nice as possible, but it's not going to be as easy as some people might think. Oop, there it is. I think I see it. I think that's the ship. If not, then fuck. A few good jumps over there would be nice. I should sheath my weapon, so I run a little bit faster. Sadly, this game doesn't have a sprint button, which would be kind of nice. Kind of cool they added that into uh, Minecraft. And into the radioactive water. Remember, kids, radioactive water is not good for you. This is the uh, Jefferson Memorial, I think. Was it Jefferson or Benjamin? I don't know. You can jump in and out of the water to maybe get some... Uh, yeah, Jefferson Memorial. Cool. Uh, be careful, this place is occupied by super mutants, so uh, I'm going to walk my merry ass over here. Now that I think I'm heading in the right direction... Yes, I am! Almost there. There it is, right there. And after this, we can go do the bigger parts of the game, such as, uh... Bigger parts of the game. Actually, no, I still need to get my 50 in lockpick. So I can get to, uh... The one bobblehead. Yeah, this place is occupied by uh, super mutants. Be fucking careful. And not just like small time super mutants. These guys even have mini guns and whatnot. 
I mean, if I took one on and killed one, I'd get myself a minigun and sell it for, like, tons of fucking money, but, uh... See, like, up there, be careful. Over there, like, it's a little barricaded a bit. Yeah, super mutants over in that direction. Not very nice. So, yeah. I don't know if I told you guys, I kind of was talking about how I can't put on the radio. <gasps> Stations, fuck! Oh god, a super unit. Oh god, oh god. That was a fucking missile. He's got a wood with a nail in it, fuck. Alright then, how would you like a few shots to the head, sir? Not to get ahead of the problem. Yes, critical strike. Yes, you can get critical hits in here. Fuck yeah. Ooh. Oh god. Ooh. That's it. <laughs> you got blood over all my good oh, bat. You know how long it took me to get this bat? Stupid super mutant nail board. And more up meat. Yay, nothing but experience points. Ooh, that nail board actually. Pretty powerful, I'll keep that. Look, it got blood all over my good baseball bat. And it disappeared. Anyway, people, welcome to Rivet City. This is where we need to go. I'm going to get my bottle cap, and I'm going to end it here, because I have to leave in a bit. I got about... 40 minutes. Not bad. Shit, I leveled up. Did not want to do that. Well, what can you do? Anyway, uh, 19 skills. I will put most of them into... Lockpick. Because I need my lockpick up. Um, melee is pretty good for now. Put five in repair. Small guns, fuck you. Sneak. sneak. Ah, this is a tough one. I don't really care about barter, really. I don't, I'm not going to be using... I'll put two in energy weapons. Can't be that bad. And you can look at future stuff, and as you can see, if you have more certain things, such as Charisma 4, you can get Child at Heart. Intelligent plus 4, ranks 1. You also have to be at a certain level, too. Like, it says level 4, we're at level 3, so we can't get this perk at all yet. Yeah, you want Comprehension, dude. Comprehension's pretty sweet. But I guess we gotta do something else. Um, I need some points in the lockpick, so that'll help. Sneak and lockpick, woohoo. Talk to that guy, he's all... Welcome to Rivet City. Please wait while the bridge extends. What bridge? What the hell are you talking about? Oh my god! Can I make it? Can I make it? Yeah! Ah, got it. Nice. Here to greet me? Hold it right there. What? State your business in Rivet City. Looking for my father, bitch. And who might your father be? If he lives on this boat, I know him. Yeah, he's lived in a vault his whole life. Oh yeah? And I'm a fairy princess. You keep up this smart-ass attitude, and you're gonna wind up floating face down in the river. Well, you guys are assholes compared to Megaton. It matters because I don't let just anybody wander around this boat. I'm responsible for these people. So either you tell me what I want to know, or you don't get on. It's pretty damn simple. Asshole. All right, all right. You can go on in. If I hear about any trouble, you're going to wind up in the river. You get me? Fine. Yeah, be careful. They have a pretty good security force compared to Megaton. Don't fuck with Rivet City. Marketplace. These guys have a huge marketplace. It's very awesome. They sell lots of stuff. They sell a good amount of weapons. And God, this is going to glitch up like a bitch. And I'm saving just for Becca. Welcome to Potomac Attire. Yeah, some of the guys actually walk around. So, like that guy, he sells apparel. The black guy, the mustache. Clinic for deck. Good to see you. Science lab is down below. Is there one more area behind here? Science lab, that way. Science lab, okay. We want to head to the science lab. The Mirelurks have been quiet lately. Science lab over here, yes. Science lab is where you want to go, because that's where the bubble head is. As soon as we get that, we can get along our merry fucking way. 
I won't worry about too much just yet because I don't have a lot of caps. What's going over here? I find your Look, Dr. Zimmer, we've been over this. We don't know about your runaway robot, and we don't care. This lab is dedicated to solving real problems. Yes, yes, yes. But Dr. Lee... Dr. Lee is trying to save lives, and your constant interruptions are interfering with those efforts. Now please, stand aside. I'm sure the good doctor's work with water purification is fascinating. But if you only knew what was at stake... The technology in that android... What's at stake? You won't tell me what's at stake. Vagaries and secrecy. A robot's a robot, Zimmer, no matter how shiny the paint job. Now, please. Ignorance and facetiousness. That's all you people are good for. Shiny paint job, indeed. You can't even imagine the Commonwealth's accomplishments. Oh, so he's a rich you asshole. Know, if you're so smart, it's like maybe you problem. could help us, hmm? But no, that never even crossed your mind. Go peddle your selfishness somewhere else. Uh -huh. Fine, but I'm not leaving. Not until I've spoken to Dr. Lee. I'll be here when she's ready to abandon her chemistry set and talk real science. Suit yourself. Yeah, he's pretty much a big asshole. Don't talk to me, thank you. What do you want? Don't talk to her either. Or at least not yet. Intelligence! Fuck yeah, I can't steal anything here, by the way. When people catch you stealing, they go hostile towards you. Keep that in mind. Intelligence is up. We are at 100 now, and I'm done. <laughs> Sadly, I can't teleport outside in five seconds. But what a can you do? Ooh, Weatherly Hotel. Important for the future. Marketplace. Hey, it's open. I'll check it out for you guys before we leave and end the video. Send my ass on my merrily way. I do the repairs around here, so if you see something that needs fixing, let me know. Sure, well, no problem. Anyway, this place, Rivet City, is pretty much a giant place. They turned a boat to a major, uh, strong place. I don't know if you want to say it. Hey there. Flack. Welcome to this here is Flack and Shrapnel's gun shop. It's gonna love this place. Pretty catchy, huh? Take a look around. If you see anything you like, I'll be right over here. Yeah, this guy, uh, aren't you afraid someone will rob you, your own, use your own your guns on you? Here, in Rivet City, I'm packing, and most of the rest of these guys are packing. Not to mention security. True. Yeah, what kind of guns do you have for Need sale? to do some killing, eh? Yeah, you're gonna love this place. I don't think you want to steal from this place, because that's where you're gonna get most of your ammunition, your... Pretty much a good shit. Mini nuke. Yes, you can fire off a fucking nuke. That's what I love about this game. Fire off nukes. So awesome. Okay, what kind of weapons do you have in general? Do you have anything in terms of laser? Laser pistol again. Hunting rifle. Actually, I actually have some shit to sell for you. Carton of cigs. Pre-war money. I'll sell that gland for now. Don't need it yet. It's just going to weigh me down. 32 calibers. I need those energy. So you can have the shotgun shells over. You might want to get your barter up a bit, just so certain things, you can sell things for a little bit more. But, like I said, barter is not really that important, and even at the, apparently, it's more apparent at the end of the game when you sell so much shit, it just doesn't even matter. Hunting rifle, my laser pistol, don't get rid of the quantums, they are slightly important. Um, I think everything else is good. Sadly, you don't have anything good just yet. Well, if I was being serious, get the Chinese assault rifles. Those things are fucking powerful, and you will... No, no. You will find... Uh, hey, BB. Gun. Another satisfied customer. I gotta run. If you need more ammo... Th Thanks, buddy. So, yeah. This guy sells ammo. This guy sells apparel, which... which I don't know if you know, but certain apparel, such as, like, our... Uh, where is it? Items. Apparel. As you can see, some of them have things such as uh, plus uh, melee weapon and speech. There's it. Plus lock, pick, and repair. Stuff like that. I should have repaired my laser rifle with the repair armor on. So yeah, here's Aquafix. This is where you get stuff like stim packs and uh, you can see the smoke in the air. Bad meds. This guy sells uh, food, which isn't that important. And yeah. Two mile luck cakes. That's about it, I think. Oh, and there's a guy over here. He sells pretty much a variety of everything. 
You can do a quest where you can actually piss them off. And, uh... I don't know, something, you do something bad to him. Anyway, that's going to be the end of this episode, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this. hope you guys enjoyed uh, this episode of Fallout 3. If the, if the videos are split up a bit, sometimes there's like the sun stop in the video. It's because of how Fraps is working. Um, like a sun stop in between my episodes. Because Fra I don't get to choose when Fraps gets to stop. And if I have to, I don't want to have to run uh, this Fallout 3 Let's Play through that many things. But I don't want to have the files huge. So I'm going to separate them to 30 minutes at a time at the very, uh at the most, and uh, the thing is, if it has like a sudden stop, like you'll me talking mid-sentence and all of a sudden it stops, it's just because that I don't want to carry it on and I don't want to have to edit the video myself, because that means it takes longer and the video loses quality, which sucks in some things, uh, so yeah, yeah, I don't care about you, wait, 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 please, do you have any water, I'm so thirsty, no, find your own water. I... What? Oh, wait, no, no, no. Just leave me to die in peace. I've been... Yeah, okay, never mind. Then. If you have purified water, you can say you give it to him, and he's like, oh, you'll give it to me for free? And then you say, fuck no, I'm not going to give it to you for free, and then you get bad karma. So. Anyway, I'm going to end the video here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And the next, we're going to start doing more things. There's another guy down there if you want more stuff, and I'll talk about it later. Anyway, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Hope you've enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Fallout 3 Evil Karma Edition. I'm Mike Jr. the Second, signing out.